So you stated that it was your profile of the killer that led you and the police to my client's door that night. Behavioral analysis was a factor in our investigation, yes. And was behavioral analysis also a factor in the Olympic Park bombings case in Atlanta? Yes, it was. And was that suspect you identified, Richard Jewell, ever convicted of the bombings? Objection. Relevance. Goes to the credibility of the witness and his field. Oh, allow it. No, he was not convicted. Because he was innocent. Your profile led you to the wrong man. Jewel was not the perpetrator, but if you look at the real Olympic Park bomber, Eric Rudolph, you'll see that our profile was dead on. Well, how about if we look at the Baton Rouge killer? Your unit said that he was white and living in the city. He was black and from the suburbs. You said that Dennis Rader, the BTK killer, was divorced and impotent. He turned out to be married with two kids. Objection, Your Honor. He's giving a sermon. You have a question in there somewhere, Counselor? Having been wrong on those cases, isn't it possible that you were wrong about Brian Matloff? No. Fact is, behavioral analysis is really just intellectual guesswork. You probably couldn't tell me the color of my socks with any greater accuracy than a carnival psychic. Objection. Withdrawn. Charcoal gray. Well, look at that. He got one right. You match them to the color of your suit to appear taller. You also wear lifts and you've had the soles of your shoes replaced. One might think you're frugal, but in fact you're having financial difficulties. You wear a fake Rolex because you've pawned the real one to pay your debts. My guess is to a bookie. I took this case pro bono. I am one of the most successful criminal attorneys in the state. Your vice is horses. Your Blackberry's been buzzing on the table every 20 minutes, which happens to be the average time between posts from Colonial Downs. You're getting race results. And every time you do, it affects your mood in court, and you're not having a very good day. That's because you pick horses the same way you practice law, by always taking the long shot. Uh, you spin a very good yarn agent, but as usual, you've proven nothing. If I'm not mistaken, the results from the fifth race should be coming through any minute. Why don't you tell us if your luck has changed? Your Honor, this is... What do you want me to do? Either show us your Blackberry or cut it loose, Counselor. <laughs>